everyone, That Cat Mommy here, and today I want to show you one of my new favorite things, and that is our new cat backpack. Now, we are not going to personally be using this to take our cats hiking, even though I think it would be a fantastic option if you were looking to do that. Um, our boys are just a little bit old. They're not used to it. I don't want to freak them out. Um, some of you guys know Feet has cancer. He doesn't have that much longer left to live. He's kind of tired, um, but he's doing okay. He's, he's not in any pain or anything like that, in case you guys are wondering. Um, he's just, he's just a little tired, so we don't want to stress him out by making them try to learn a new fun thing to do for us, but I did want to get these because I was concerned that if we had a fire, I live in an apartment complex, that I wouldn't be able to get him out of the building and his brother in any kind of orderly fashion because we'd have to put them in their cages and try to get out of the building with two cat cages. It would just be kind of a nightmare. So I've been wanting these just in case for any reason, you know, if there was a flood or or tornado or something where we had to get out quickly, we could put them in something that would be easy to get out from wherever we want to go. So this is kind of like our emergency plan. But like I said, again, I've been wanting these forever and I finally got them this year. I did a ton of research on them, which is why I finally ended up with the one that I got. And you might notice the one that I got it's not as cutesy as necessarily some of the other ones that you see out there might be. But I picked this one up for several different reasons. And the number one being, I honestly believe that this is the best backpack on the market for what it does and exactly what you need for your cat. I'm going to link in the description box to my Amazon account where you can actually check out this backpack. I do want to let you guys know it's an affiliate link. I never promote anything on my channel if you're new that I don't believe in, that I don't believe my cats would use. That's just not the type of person that I am. I'm not going to promote something just to make a buck. And you're always going to get my honest opinion and my honest feedback and why I want something. But it is an affiliate link, which means if you buy it, I get paid like probably less than a dollar, like 50 cents, because it's not really expensive. <laughs> so it's not like I'm making a ton of money on it either. But I do want to be fully transparent with you guys. But anyways, let's talk about this cool cat backpack and why I picked this one. So the first reason I picked this one as opposed to, it's got my hair on it already, um, as opposed to all the many other ones out there on the market is because it has this mesh. Okay, this mesh is in the front, this mesh is at the top, this mesh is on the sides, both sides. And some of the other ones I had seen had like this big plastic bubble, which looks adorable. But based on what I had read, those don't have enough ventilation or not the best ventilation. This kind of setup with the mesh where it has much more room to breathe is a much better situation than the air holes. And I believe this is like an upgraded version of this bag. Like I think this is like the second one they came out with um, and made it better. But I did look at all the cutesy ones, but I was like, you know, if I'm gonna get one, I'm gonna do this right. I wanna make sure that it's gonna be comfortable for them. Because in a situation where we do have to leave because of a fire, and let's just say we lost everything, like this might be their travel carrier for a while. So I wanted to make sure that it, it would be pretty comfortable for them. So that is one of the reasons why. The other reason why, I'm gonna show you guys in a minute, I'm gonna tease you, but you're not gonna believe what this thing does, okay? Because it looks kind of compact. Uh, another reason I picked this is because my kitties are heavy. Um, they're a little plump, little some plump babies, huh? Um, they are not the lightest thing in the world and I needed one that held up to something that was about 20 pounds because my boys are 15 and a lot of the smaller ones were only for animals that were 10 pounds and I was like that, that will never work for my boys. So that was another reason I picked this one. This one is insane with how many different ways you have to unzip, like pretty much the whole thing unzips. You can unzip the side. Okay, both sides. Both sides do the same thing. You can unzip this top part and you can unzip the bottom part. Okay, so it's fully unzippable. So if you wanted to store it, you could. 
we don't have ours stored uh, just because we don't want the cats to be scared of this. In a event of an emergency, we want it to be something they're comfortable with. So these actually sit in our living room. They play in them. Sometimes they sit in them. Sometimes I'll take them for walks around the apartment in them just to get them used to them. And I was really shocked when we did our first apartment walk how comfortable they were in them. They were like, hey, it's cool. We're hanging out. Okay, so... They were super comfortable in them. You can zip this part up, and when you're hiking, or if you, I mean, I'm assuming it would be for a hike. If you're hiking, you want to make sure that you use a, a harness for your cat, because inside here, there is a leash latch where you can latch your cat to this latch so that it won't jump out, okay? So there's going to be no reason why kitty might get hurt and, and jump out and you know run away or something like that but they can poke their head out and it has the leash strap in here which you can attach them to so they don't uh, get too crazy it has this nice durable pad it is pretty thick it is water resistant on the bottom and then on the top it's this fuzzy thing but this is going to protect you in case kitty has an accident okay so if kitty has an accident it's not going to be running down your back now, it also features these adorable pockets, okay, which I thought, if you're hiking, is really great. You could put, you know, a little collapsible water dish in here, uh, your phone, and it has different pockets. So, it's like a, a big pocket here, and then there's littler pockets inside here. So, almost like a little tiny pocketbook, um, and it has those on both sides. Now, I did tease you with the super cool part. This is another reason I bought it. You can see the backpack back here. I will show you guys real quick this, where it has the adjustable straps and it has this part that goes across your chest to really lock it in place and give you security. But here is where the magic happens. So you have this really cool thing that you can pop out. And now you have a area where your cat can lay inside this area, okay, comfortably. So like if you were sitting down at a park or something like that, you didn't want your kitty to just be crammed inside this little small pocket for a, for a long period of time. You can put it, expand it out and it's so much bigger. And it has a zipper here, all made like that. Again, I was thinking, if for some reason, God forbid, my house burnt down, I don't know where I would go. You know, I mean, I'd probably go to my mom's. She has two dogs. How would the cats feel about that? You know, I would need some place for them to be able to feel safe and they would be able to feel, you know, somewhat at home. So I really wanted something that expanded just in case because I thought this was a little too small for them. So I'm gonna show you guys. Um, the feet will, will work with me. Will you work with me, baby? They love getting in it. In fact, when we first got this bag, it's hilarious. Come here. Come here. Whoop. Come here. Come on. Come in. When we first got this bag, he was sleeping in it. And it was crazy. See, there he goes. Whoop, whoop. And we'll just shut him up in there again. My cats are 15 pounds. When feet was last measured, he was 15 pounds and some ounces. And you can see, here he is. And this part folds back. So he can go in and out, but he's totally comfortable in here. He fits in here. He was taking naps in here when we first got this thing. It was actually insane how he just went and took a little nap in there, didn't you? Didn't you take a little nap? Yeah, and I'll show you guys again. Big enough for them to lay down, big enough for them to nap in. Um, and again, if you're taking your cats hiking, I would think you would want something like this. A lot of the other ones I have seen do not have a feature like this. And again, all of this unzips, so if you didn't want to put them in this particular way, it's still new, so the zippers are still newish. There you go, baby. Um, if you want to get out, you can. Um, but this is it. And it has this cool little tab, too, so that this flap won't um, get in your way if your cat happens to be wanting to poke its head out while you're walking or something like that. That uh, It has some Velcro here, so this part can stay flipped back. And here it is, all set up, super adorable, and very easy just to collapse. Like whenever you're done, you're like, okay, I'm done. Done, kitty, we're gonna go back to the car, wherever. 
you just fold it up. Make sure you get it in the side here. Not a professional at this, just got these. Um, but you just fold it back up, turn it over. This is fully, um, it's really, really light considering that you uh, are gonna, it, it does so much, it's got so much in it, it really is light. And one of the great things about it is this back is padded. So you're not gonna get, you're not like right up against the cat. Again, if the cat was to have an accident for some reason, you're not gonna be walking through the woods with cat pee on you, because that would not be fun. So you can see the back right here, fully collapsible. And there you go. So I wanna show you, I wanted to show you guys like what it actually is like when you're wearing it. So let's head over to that video and I'm gonna show you guys a clip of me actually walking around in it with the cat. Now, the bag is super light, but when you put the cat in it, it does get a little bit heavier. And I will say the one thing that I found when I was wearing it and when I was carrying the cat, it feels like a backpack, like when I was in school. And when I was in school, we had big heavy textbooks and they were thick and we had to carry a backpack full of them around. And that's kind of what this reminds me of um, on the bottom. When I was in high school and I was having to carry these books around, uh, sometimes the heavy books would be sitting on my back and I could feel them sitting there. I do feel that with this backpack, but it could just be that I need to adjust the straps or something like that. But I wouldn't say it's like, Oh, it's light as a feather and it's you know super easy but again I'm using this as an escape route I'm not using it to hike with my cat but again I think even if you are hiking with a backpack I don't hike with backpacks I never have so I don't know what it's like to hike with a backpack <laughs> um, but I would imagine this wouldn't be too bad the one weird thing about it which again I think would be an issue with any cat backpack that you happen to have is that if your cat moves around, it's gonna shift the weight of the backpack, which shifts the weight on you, which is a little awkward at times. There's nothing that I see with this backpack that you wouldn't have the exact same issue with another backpack. It is just what it is, it's a backpack. Um, but you can see this is very comfortable on me. It is very fun for the cat. Boots actually loves doing this. I take him for walks around the apartment all the time. Again, because I don't want them to be scared of this in the event that we have to go somewhere. So we still use their cat carriers when we take them to the vet because we don't want them to associate this with going to the vet. I wouldn't suggest this as like a full-time carrier type situation, uh, just because again, at the vet, I don't know if they have space to pop this open. You wouldn't really want them, I wouldn't think, to be in this little confined area for, you know, I mean, maybe if it was a kitten because it's a little bit bigger, but. With a big cat, you're gonna, they're gonna need to be able to get out or you're gonna need to be able to pop it out um, when you get to wherever you're going, if you're hiking or again, like if you're using it like me as an emergency situation. I couldn't believe the price on this when I got it. In fact, it was cheaper than some of the bigger brands which didn't have the features that I liked. So I can't recommend this to you guys enough if you've been thinking about getting a cat hiking backpack or if you think, you know, you've heard what I've had to say and you know, you're like, you know, maybe I, I do need something like that for my animals. I think it's a wise investment and I definitely can't recommend it enough to all you cat owners. So thanks guys for checking out this video. Until I see you next time, remember to keep living your most perfect life.